Here are your Monday morning Manchester United headlines. Roy Keane believes Harry Maguire and Victor Lindelof should NT be at Manchester United if they cannot step in competently when called upon. The United duo were handed a rare start together in Sunday's Premier League clash against Nottingham Forest at the City Ground, following injuries to both Rafael Varane and Lissandro Martinez in Thursday's Europa League clash against Sevilla. Eric Ten Hag's side collapsed in the final few minutes of that game, throwing away a two-goal lead. But with Martina's injury a season-ender while Varane is out for a few weeks both Lindelof and Maguire will be tasked with marshalling the Reds' defence for the foreseeable future. The futures of both are uncertain as it stands, with United reportedly eyeing at least one new centre-back. Keane believes the next few games could go some way to deciding what the pair do this summer, adding that neither should be at the club if they cannot step in and cover for Martinez and Varane. Read what the former Manchester United captain had to say here. Manchester United were seemingly unfazed by the last-minute injury to Marcel Sabitzer ahead of their 2-0 win at Nottingham Forest on Sunday. Sabitzer was originally set to start in midfield at the city ground alongside Bruno Fernandes and Casemiro, but the Austrian was seen leaving United's warm-up early with concerns over his fitness. Christian Eriksen was subsequently informed at the last minute he will fill in, with the Danish international enjoying a first start since his return from injury. A late change had little effect on Eric Ten Hag's side who dominated from the off at Forest, taking a well-deserved lead midway through the first half when Antony got a first touch on a rebound of Anthony Marshall's effort. The Reds saw countless chances come and go, with concerns of a sucker punch growing despite a lack of threat from Steve Cooper's side. Eventually, Antony set up Diogo Dalit for United's second with 15 minutes to go. And following the result, Eriksen and Fernandez explained how they reacted to the news that Sabitzer would not be in the starting lineup. Read what they had to say here.